damned souls, us three. Obviously, there aren't any physical torments. You agree, don't you? And yet, we're in hell, the three of us, together, forever. In short, there's someone absent here, the official torturer. Whatever do you mean? I mean that each of us will act as the torture of the two others. Standing in a line, ladies all dressed up so fine, but their heads have got to go. Heads and hats roll down. Attention, teachers, at this time, we please release the Jay and Boys baseball team. Thank you. To see the merry show. Excuse me, do you happen to have a glass? Any sort of glass will do, uh, a pocket mirror, perhaps. Have to talk to me, but you might lend me a glass. Don't worry, I have a glass in my bag. It's gone. Ugh, they must have taken it at the entrance. How tiresome. What's the matter? I feel so queer. Don't you ever get taken that way? I feel as if I can't really and truly see myself, I won't really exist. I'll tap myself to make sure, but. It doesn't help much. You're lucky. I'm always conscious of myself, in my mind. Painfully conscious. Uh, yes, in one's mind, but everything that happens in one's mind is so vague, isn't it? Makes one want to sleep. I used to have six big mirrors in my bedroom in which I could see myself, but they never saw me. Whenever I'd talk to people, I'd always make sure one was around in which I could see myself. Somehow it kept me alert to see myself as others saw me. Oh dear, my lipstick's all smudged. I can't live without a glass forever. I simply can't. Suppose I try and be your glass. Come, dear, pay me a visit. There's a spot for you on my sofa. But, but he doesn't count. <sighs> what if we try to hurt each other? Do I look as if I wanted to hurt you? One never can tell. It's much more likely you hurt me. Still, what does it matter? If I'm to suffer, it may as well be at your hands. Your pretty hands. Come closer. Closer. Look into my eyes. What do you see? Oh, I'm there, but I'm so tiny. It doesn't help much. My lips, are you sure they look all right? As good as when I first came in. Far better. Ruler. Mouth is quite diabolical that way. Good gracious, how could you like them like that? It's so maddening not being able to see myself. Miss Serrano, are you quite sure? It looks all right. You're lovely as stuff. I wish he would think so. Oh, of course, because he's a man. You've won, but look at her, damn it. Don't pretend you haven't heard a word of what we said. Let's all just sit down, quite quietly. We'll Look at the floor and try to forget the others are there. To forget about the others? How utterly absurd. I can still feel you there in every pore. Your silence clamors my ears. You, you could cut out your tongue and nail your mouth shut, but I, you can't prevent your being there. Can you stop your thoughts? I can hear them ticking away like a clock. Tick, tock, tick, tock. And I'm certain you hear mine. You'd go on sitting there in some sort of trance like a yogi. And even though I couldn't see her, I know that every sound she made and every rustle of her dress was for your benefit. Throwing you smiles, I couldn't see. Well, I prefer to choose my hell. I prefer to look you straight in the eye and fight it out face to face. 